is just in. August is hotter than ever at Appalachian Wireless as they are slashing all normal contract pricing on all smartphones by 50% when you sign up for service. Better service, bigger savings. Serving you for the last 25 years at Appalachian Wireless. The inaugural class of the Kentucky College of Optometry in Pikeville is already on campus and classes have already started despite the fact that construction of the building that will house the College of Optometry is still under construction. We tagged along recently as Dr. Andrew Bazzelli, Dean of the Optometry School, gave a tour of the building to the inaugural class officers. Dr. Bazzelli began the tour on the seventh floor patio a place he says offers the best view of the mountains, which were the main inspiration for the building's design. There's blue and green throughout all the floors to symbolize the mountain. Even as you look at the glass on the building, the glass is all designed, so we bring the mountains to the inside. The school is designed specifically to be a symbol of one of the outstanding buildings in central Appalachia, at the outstanding University of Central Appalachia. Floor by floor, Dr. Bazzelli showed the students where classrooms, faculty offices, and study areas would be located. And if there's any question in your mind, yes, I put in about four times as much study space as eating and relaxing space. Because <laughs> for the next four years, it's about studying. That's why you're here, and your patients depend on you. You know, that's as simple as I can put it. Crews averaging between 80 and 120 workers are working seven days a week to complete the building, which many people said would never be built. I was at a Board of Trustees meeting, and I said to the Board of Trustees, I was amazed at how many people told me that we couldn't do this. And they told me it would just take years, and we did it in two years. One of the Board of Trustees members said to me, that's just the way we do things in the mountains. Dr. Bazzelli says the project is on schedule with the completion date of December 16th. Reporting in Pikeville for EKB News, I'm Shannon Deskins.